Hey there and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to go over the latest Dogecoin news and an updated price analysis. Before we begin with the video, make sure to subscribe to our channel if you want to always be updated on the latest crypto news and if you enjoy crypto related content. Also, if you are interested in investing into crypto or day trading cryptos, don't forget to check out our link in the description below for the safest crypto exchange that I personally use which allows leverage trading even in the US. With that being said, let's jump straight to the video now. So first off, let's check Dogecoin at CoinMarketCap and this one is on the 9th spot with a price of 0.2417, meaning that there is a 1.39% decrease from yesterday's price and a market cap of $31.73 billion. So ex Goldman Sachs Dogecoin millionaire joins UK healthcare company. So a Goldman Sachs manager who quit after making millions from the meme-based cryptocurrency Dogecoin has re-emerged as the executive chairman of a UK healthcare company. Asis McMahon will join Spectrum X as executive chairman, focusing on investor relations, corporate governance, and the formulation of the company's new ESG policy. McMahon was formerly the head of the emerging market sales at the U.S. Investment Bank, but he resigned after profiting from Dogecoin's meteoric rise this year. ASIC McMahon, an early stage investor in the company, said that having supported Spectrum X since the outset, he's excited to agree to an executive chairman role. He looks forward to ensuring the company continues its path of success as it becomes a public company, adhering to strict ESG standards including carbon neutrality, transparent investor relations, and the highest standards in corporate governance. Then, Spectrum X is a UK best healthcare and pharmaceuticals firm focused on bringing a new respiratory therapy known as SPC069 to market. It also intends to roll out the most powerful hand sanitizer in the world to the NHS and other healthcare clients. Damien Hancock, who is the CEO and co founder of Spectrum X, commented on McMahon's appointment. He said that as an early stage cornerstone investor, Asis has been a key team member and an advisor since their inception. They are delighted he has agreed to this appointment where he will focus his abilities and wealth of experience in the development of their group as they enter this exciting new phase ahead of their listing. It is unclear how much money McMahon made from Dogecoin, the world's ninth largest cryptocurrency by market cap, before leaving Goldman's after working there for more than 14 years. Next up, new Dogecoin upgrade will reduce transaction costs. One would think that after all the conspiracy and bad publicity thrown at Elon Musk and his influence on the crypto industry and specifically Dogecoin, he would definitely back out and he would let the professionals handle it. But that's not who Elon Musk is. Elon Musk has a history of supporting Dogecoin post his Bitcoin mingle and not only this, but Elon Musk has used his influence several times to get his way within the crypto market. Dogecoin dev team, with the account title Doge Whisper, took the social media to announce the importance of the recent upgrade with Dogecoin has managed to go through. Mark issued a tweet back in August that the new Doge upgrade was essential to making the network secure, faster and more efficient and plus managing the costs in real time. This tweet has managed to find some traction only now as the Dodge nodes are being updated as we discuss. There is an ample requirement of nodes being added within the network and their upgrade is also a crucial aspect that the cryptocurrency has to deal with. At the time of this video about 763 Doge nodes have been upgraded and the work is underway for the implementation of the new Doge nodes. Even when the network is undergoing a solid upgrade and might possibly get there by the end of this year, but still there is no improvement within the price of Dogecoin. All the rallying and influence of Elon Musk and Mark Cuban couldn't bring the coin to cross 1. And recently Dogecoin has plummeted all the way to 0.30 with supports now lurking at 0.22. Bitcoin is not doing so great as well as the flagship cryptocurrency is below the 50k price limit. Now, we're going to move on to a price analysis, but before we do that, if you have enjoyed the content so far, I ask you to please destroy the like button as it really helps me grow the channel and I really do appreciate it. Lastly, Dogecoin price is on a downtrend toward 0.20. So Dogecoin price action has been respecting at the Sentin Trend channel for 9 consecutive days now. Sellers are looking to book profit around 0.20 which falls in line with the low from September 7th. 
Dogecoin price has been moving in the downward trend channel since September 7th and in the beginning of the Doge trend formation. Price action could still have flipped to the upside with the help of the 55-day and the 200-day simple moving averages. In the meantime, price action has been trending lower and both the 200-day and the 55-day SMA have turned into resistance now. Doge bears now have two very supportive elements in their corner to push prices lower. Buyers in Dogecoin are, however, trying to ramp the price up with multiple tests of the upper trend line of the descending trend channel. Sellers are standing firm and defending their sharp view with great success. As the interest for Doge bulls starts to fade, expect sellers to take over price action further and run the price down towards 0.20. That level was the low from September 7th and will be targeted level for Doge bears to book profit on their short positions, if not all their profit. Expect buyers to come in at that 0.20 mark to start building up some long positions in the handover from sellers booking profit. If that level does not hold, at 0.19 the monthly S1 support level is waiting to do its duty. In a broader price range, Doge bulls could go for a fade trade to get long. Suppose sellers are stubborn and do not let any opportunity for the buyers to get in. In this case, expect to push through as one Thor 0.15 and that level coincides with the low from June 22nd. Alright everyone, so that was it for today's video. If you got some valuable information out of it, please don't forget to give it a like and also leave a comment down below on what you think. Subscribe and hit the bell to receive notifications every time we post a new video. As always, I'll be seeing you in the next one and now I'll leave you with the crypto meme of the day.